Hey folks, Thomas here. Welcome back to Beers Lab. In today's video, I'm going to show you a great way to trim the end of your cables if you don't have a wire stripper. Let's say you have a cable and you need to trim the end of it to splice it to something else. So let's just cut that connector right off of there. Normally you would just use a pair of wire strippers like these and that would take the outer sheathing off like that. Voila. And then you can do the inside of it and everything's great. But what if you don't have this? Well, this one also works really well. You just put it right in there and just go whoop, pull it right off, and away you go. Awesome. That also works really well. Okay. But, what if you don't have one of those? Well, what you could do is you could grab your, uh, your Leatherman tool here, and you could cut it around like that. Careful not to cut yourself. There we go. Uh, but the problem with this way is... Uh, when you do it like that, sometimes these wires get broken right there where you cut it. And that's no good. So, what if you don't want that to happen and you don't have any fancy tools? Well, this is what you do right here. Okay. You take your knife, and you don't cut this way. You cut this way instead. Check it out. Yeah, so you just start maybe an inch of the way down. Just dig the tip of your knife in there. And just cut it along there. And if it does damage anything, it's only going to damage maybe one little wire right there. You don't even need to cut all the way through. You just go like that, and then you can take the sheathing, and then you just pull it back like that. There we go. And away you go. Just pull all those wires out of there. And we'll take our knife, we'll trim that off there like that. And away you go. Then you can just twist that on there, around there. There you go. And then you can do the same thing for the inside part too. Just take it, the knife tip right where you want it to go. You don't have to stick it in all the way. I said all the way to the, you go all the way to the end and then you can cut deeper at the end so it's a little bit easier to split. And there we go. Okay, then you just take your knife, just cut that little bit off there, you twist that, and just twisting that up, and boom, these are ready for some solder, and that's a really nicely trimmed cable, and we didn't even have to use any wire strippers or anything like that, we just used a regular old knife. Cool, thanks a lot for watching folks, this is Thomas here, see you next time.